Hey guys, the objectives of this video are to calculate impulse on an object and uh, to deduce final momentum and velocity. So the problem we have here is we have a 50 kilogram box uh, which is being dragged across a smooth frictionless surface by a 90 newton force applied at 30 degrees to the horizontal. So that's what this uh, diagram here is showing. Uh, we've, might, we've been asked to find the final velocity of the wooden box if the force is applied for 10 seconds. So the way we're going to be doing that basically is we're going to be using um, our impulse and momentum relationship. So uh, as you know, uh, the impulse is the change in momentum. So we have a box which is initially stationary, uh, meaning that the initial velocity of that box is zero. So hence the initial momentum is zero. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be finding out the final momentum uh, using um, impulse, so we know that it's a certain force over a certain time gives us an impulse That's going to allow us to find the final momentum and from that we'll be able to work out the final velocity So we can get stuck into this question now. So we'll, we'll start off uh, by drawing a free body diagram so What I've drawn in here is our free body diagram and so what we're going to be doing with this the reason we need to draw this free body diagram is we need to check that um, this you can see that this force is applied at an angle So we're going to check that this box isn't going to be lifted off the um off the ground because it, if it if it is then we're going to be we're going to need to um Work out the momentum in both the X and the Y directions. So it'll if it's lifted off the ground It's going to be dragged um, In the X direction and it's going to also have a momentum in the Y direction. So here's our free body diagram